I play Lady Sif in Thor, and she's kind of Thor's right-hand man, in a way. Uh, she looks after him and protects the kingdom, so wherever he goes, she goes. She's very loyal, and uh, she's a butt kicker, for sure. It's such an amazing, um, just an amazing thing. It was an amazing experience to be a part of Thor. Uh, it was such a, an amazing script, and the people that I worked with were incredible, and uh, I just, I can't wait to see you know, what this brings in the future in this franchise. I think there's a lot of avenues we can explore. I think everybody in the film brings uh, something different to, to it um, because everybody's so individual and we're all so different. We're from so many different countries. That's the thing, it was a very international cast. So because we're all from different cultures, I think that played into, you know, uh, me being from Texas, I've got kind of a tough girl personality and that was a fun side to bring to Sif. And Chris is from Australia and I find that Aussies are so welcoming and warm and, and just and fun and he brought that to Thor. And um, it, I don't know, it was just, it was so much fun. And then of course you have Anthony Hopkins and, and he brings this very debonair, very powerful king, you know, and which I think he is in real life anyway, you know. And, uh, it was great. I, I love that we were so international. Working with Kenneth Branagh, this is my first big feature film, and I have to say I'm completely spoiled now. He was such an amazing director, and he gave us so much creative freedom that I, I just, I hope, I pray that I have another experience like this, you know? Maybe I wish I could just, like, put him in my pocket and take him with me wherever I needed to go, you know? You know, I think Thor has so many different, uh, uh, it's so many different genres in one, really. You know, Thor's, it's really funny. There's so much comedy. It's action, it's romance, it's adventure. I think it sort of plays to a wide audience, which is great because I think, you know, if you don't even know the story of Thor, you won't be lost because we set it up for you. Um, you don't have to be a comic book fan to love this movie. Well, there are a few scenes in Thor that I personally love. There's the, the, the destroyer fight in general is, is epic. I mean, it's huge. I mean, there's explosions, there's action, there's fighting, there's, uh, you know, otherworldly creatures are involved. And then, you know, then you have the opening sequence, which is Jotunheim, which is this whole other world that's so incredible. And I think people will really like the adventure and the fighting aspect of this film. It's done so well. And also, I love the funny scenes with Kat Dennings. I mean, she's a hoot. She's such an awesome girl, and she's so funny. Um, and I think my favorite scene would probably be where Chris, uh, as Thor, goes into a pet shop. And you'll see what I mean when you see the, the film. It was, uh, it was pretty great.